Alright, what is up guys and welcome to one of our first at least live Wi-Fi battle. I want to try this out since I got my new setup going on. Set up, but you know, I, I got a free space, right? I'm a bit of a man hole basically, right? Man cave, I guess you call it. Where I can do whatever I like and you know, some people like to design some kind of um, home bar. Somebody might actually make a porn uh, corner. I myself will build Pokemon corner. I think that's manly. I think uh, as uh, soon to be 29 years old, that's that's where it's at. That's that's what you like. That's what you want. So we're gonna go against my good friend here, Carl Oscar, and I build a PU team here, which are passable. But since it's Carl, against Carl Oscar, it might actually do fairly well. Oh snap! But, <laughs> but really though, it's not that serious. I have a few things going on here that are. Um, relevant there is that of course a roar will set up, but outside of that, it's uh, it's a, just a standard PU team with not so many cool things going on, and that's kind of the point. Um, how are you guys doing today, by the way? I seem to just ramble off here. You know, I'm cool and all. Oh, look at that! That's a trick room team. That's a trick room team right there. Uh, what I'm going to do right away is actually take a picture of the team. While I can't look at it on my DS screen, I prefer to have it uh, just the side of my table. So what I do is basically I take the picture of that's not the team. Uh, I do like this. Oh, that's that's pretty darn sharp. So like that basically, and I put it down below so I can see it right there. Um, now from the get-go here, it's very clear that... Um, you know, somewhere down the line here, I think his, um, can't really stress this enough, uh, <laughs> his Reggie Giga is going to play a, a massive role here. Now, the thing I see here that really stands out is um, that um, he doesn't have anything to stop Volt Switching, so my right you can be fairly decent. Um, he doesn't have any stealth rock immunity either. Uh, so with that in mind, I think I'm going to lead off with my golem, which is a defensive golem actually with, um, uh, what do you call it? Um, with leftovers. Nothing to it really. So yeah, anyway, with that, let's of course go into the match. So yeah, Carlos got tend to take some time also to make his moves, so I'll try to be as entertaining as I can. Uh, he's really overthinking, so... That's good knowing up and going up against him that uh, he has uh, some kind of blackout mentally. Uh, it's not a blackout, but he really, really takes all his options in mind. So Carbank is his lead. Uh, it's a good lead. Um, the thing is here, I kind of want to lead off with going for an earthquake first. Um, scouting for... Um, or not necessarily scouting. Damn, I wish I had heavy slam right now. But uh, if I go for a quick first, I can potentially weaken his possible sash. He's not sash though, he's definitely metal herb. Uh, I also kind of want to scout for the magic coat. Uh, I can get, avoid both by actually just going for earthquake straight on at it. Um, he should go for trick room directly. Uh, if he doesn't do that, his switches aren't taking earthquake that nicely. The wishy washy clearly can take it if it so needs to. I don't have a switch into Wishy Washy either, so that's, that's going to be interesting. Um, so it does stay in Elise, so I'm pretty sure he goes to Trick Room. My Earthquake could do 50%. Oh, it's up there. It's up there. Um, right there it goes. Actually, Stealth Rocks, right. Uh, with that in mind, I kind of want to defeat him. He's no threat for me, though. I don't lose anything by going for Stealth Rocks on my own. Hoping it goes for Trick Room. Um, right, that's his option. Yeah, there we go, there's a Trick Room. So my best play here is just go for Toxic. It could go for Moonblast. Um, but Toxic is my best play mainly because I do believe he wants to stay in. It goes for Explosion, alright. Doesn't take any chances. Um, that shouldn't do anything to me though. Uh, and we're we gonna reveal clearly toxic here, so probably should have KO'd him if I had a chance uh, Because now his switches are coming. They're gonna be threatening. They're gonna be feisty and they're going to be named wishy-washy huh. Damn, I kind of wish I had um, Guslo right now. I, I kind of walked in through to it You know, I didn't desire it. Wishy-washy is his switch in here. 
anything else will be wrong. It will be slightly disgusting, and I'm okay with it. I do believe Duition, that Reuniclus variant there, can learn Blue Beast. Yeah, that's... I, I know you. I remember. <laughs> Shit. Um, but Wishing, I do believe that thing learns Energy Ball, so that's also an option. Um, what do Calyx do? I mean, it's basically start crying, I believe. I don't have any proper way of um, taking a waterfall or anything like that. I kind of realize that halfway through now. This is this is not good. This is not something you want to see. Um, I need to survive a few turns somehow. Oh dear lord! I was so adamant here beginning, like you know, I'm I'm gonna do this. Uh, I really just have to hope he is some kind of. Uh, like, this is my only option, and it's a stupid option, but it's the best way I got. Um, I really hope that he is some kind of specially offensive variant. Uh, my... Uh, what do you call him? That's not Pyro, at least. Damn, I can't remember its name. Uh, Incineroar is Assault Vest. Can I hope for Surf? It's Waterfall. This is gonna sting. Ugh. Damn, not him a Water Resist. Kinda damage, isn't it? See Life Orb, right? Face palm right now. That's all I can say. What I'm gonna do is uh, I'm gonna switch this guy in. And I'm gonna go for rapid spin. Basically, what I wanna do is um, go for rapid spin. Uh, hope I get the rocks out of the way. And remain my sash on my. Um, what do you call it? On my Rorus. That way I could sack something else. Sadly, and um, get my Aurora Veil up hopefully after this. I don't believe an earthquake should be near KO. Um, it's definitely a gamble here. It's definitely a gamble. Um, it does have a spinner blocker, which is good. Though I am free falling right here. I am definitely free falling. Man, I should have just stopped it. Ah, I was definitely overestimating my options from there. Crick Room clearly puts me on the timer directly. And I was second free monster and one because I wanted killed by the wish washy. Yeah, it's not okay. <laughs> That's not right. <laughs> it's cool though, it's cool. I'm basically you know, mentally like pushed back at the moment like you know, I had the option to not be in this situation, I decided against it, and here I am. And that sucks. Copic is not a threat, but it can definitely put a pressure on you early on. Uh, he definitely made a bad play though, by actually knocking over Trick Room turn 1, then Stealth Rocks, but then again, I fell for it, so, you know, it is what it is. Uh, goes to Hidden Power, oh, don't be Hidden Power, fire. Oh, you motherfucker, okay, that's... That's GG. God, it's you, you. How many turns do I left? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, Jesus Christ. I, I, I knew this could happen. I didn't want to know about it, but here we are. I'm sacking this mana, I can't do anything. Uh, the trick room will be over after this, I'm sure. Uh, then I just send in my Alolan Raichu and just spam Thunderbolt, basically. That's all I got. That's the strat right now. Twist the dimension back to normal, that's okay.
I don't think he has too good of a switch in here. So all I'm gonna do is go for um, a Spex Volt switch. Uh, what I wanna see is... Um, well, I don't know what I wanna see. Guess the duition. He's gonna withdraw the Blue Beast as he'll go to Reggie Gigas. Alright. This could work for me, actually, because uh, I am limber. I am limber. Wow, that didn't do anything. That's a salt vest. Because I got a weird set here, which I really, really, really like. Um, it's not viable. It's not supposed to be viable. It's just supposed to be something weird. I like something weird. Hopefully he doesn't have Drain Punch. Most likely he has. So what I'm gonna do now is go for um, a happy hour <laughs> on Passion. Um I really hope Drain Punch doesn't do too much to me. Um, I will be at plus one on my defense. Though the issue is here that I'm still Persian. So the defenses here aren't necessarily that interesting. Uh, though any extra defense do help, as I hope he goes for Thunder Wave here. Oh, it's still Assault Vest, right? Ooh, we, we take that like a champ, though. Um, it doesn't recover too much here, so that's a good thing. Um, he won't care who else next turn, though. The question is whether or not uh, Hale will stuff with us down here. Um, how long has Hale been? Like two, three turns, I guess. So just gonna go for a turn, hoping it does some kind of damage here. Um, really hope this KSO, to be completely honest, it shouldn't. Oh, it doesn't. Ah, oh, dear God, this is not working. Oh no! <laughs> no, not like that. Not like that. All right, all right, fair enough. Um. I mean, I kind of had the idea that I was going to lose anyway, but kind of didn't want to acknowledge it. Uh, fuck. Well, I was 5-0 last time with this team, so no, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're not doing too good. We are definitely not doing too good. Hopefully I'm 4-0 this time instead, 4% of 5-0. I really need to reevaluate this team. Um, did I really make that play too early? No, I don't think so. I don't think I had the options to do any other play, to be completely honest. Uh, as Rain Punch doesn't do necessarily anything. Um, Hill stopped. Damn, that would have been nice. Should probably will his now first. No, I shouldn't. There was no way I was gonna kill at the wish you anyways, it doesn't necessarily matter. Oh damn lord, Trick Room did threw me off. I was so aware of it though, I was so aware of it, yet I didn't do anything about it. Ah, that's Pokemon for you. <laughs> really short life though, where is that? I do believe like if, if this couldn't be possibly more than like a few, few turns. Like, basically, we're looking at the game around 12 turn as best. It's a very quick game here, a very quick loss, most certainly. Uh, now, perk here is that my golem is faster than anything on his team, I'm sure, since he decided to have, of course, Trick Room team. Bad part is that I have no way of stopping the vision. No way of stopping it whatsoever. Um, so what I really, really need to... Uh, it doesn't matter. I'll lose, like, anyway. There is a BHM and that's... Um, at least I'm faster. At least I'm faster. But yeah, I, I'm pretty sure an, he's gonna have energy ball or psychic. Anything there kind of kills me. So... Um, he could be speedy. That would be quite a twist. Um, should probably switch that. Oh, wait. Ooh. That's... That's helpful. That's really helpful. Wow. That's awesome. Just, just maybe this isn't over. Kind of is, but still. 
because he has to sacrifice. Let's look at his team again, um, for my sake. Uh, we have Duishion, we have uh, Furfro. He has Furfro, that's disgusting. Um, Duishion can set up a trick room. That's his only trick room set at this moment. This is not over. He needs to go to Duishion though this time around. Um, I do believe we wall out Furfro. Um, but what I, I really need to do is uh, keep Earthquaking, actually. Uh, if Furfro comes in, I I'm gonna talk to that. that. That's the plan, basically. Uh, because he needs to get a free switch into... Uh... Oh man, I wish I could do more to Dwishin. I mean, if it is defensive, I'm not gonna KO it. It's in, They usually pack Recover. If I like Recover, Trick Room, uh, and then basically fill him with Psychic... Um, and Shadow Ball, possibly Focus Blast. I do believe Shadow Ball is the one to go with. If it learns Focus Blast, that is, it might actually be a Reuniclus exclusive. Um, damn it, Crawl, you kind of need to make a move now. I really want him to just send in. That, that's the wrong mod, though. I really want to see something else. As, um, here's the thing I'm gonna try to preserve Calyx. Um, this probably wasn't wrong call, but I'm pretty sure we go for a freak room right away, and I can go for a Volt Switch predicting the um, the fur throw that is following. That's what I'm gonna try at least. But like I said, he could have Shadow Ball if it does, so I'm kind of losing here anyway. Um, see, actually, call mine. That's not helpful. That's that's not right. Damn it! That's that's not gonna work. Um, I hope Thunderbolt does something anyway. Did not foresee that. Did not foresee that at all. Now I can only hope it doesn't have Trick Room. I have no way of doing super effective damage with him. I should definitely feel I should have Shadow Ball here, but it wouldn't have mattered in this matchup anyway. It's a good thing though if he goes for a KO. If he goes for a KO, that's a good thing. Uh, because then I get to whittle him down. Even though Thunderbolt shouldn't do a whole lot. Uh, and if he goes for Trick Room, then he's still in the same spot. It does okay damage though. It does okay. Shadow Ball is definitely a KO. For Luffy. Um, now it's whether or not Earthquake actually KOs. Wow, actually... I actually kind of turn this one around, depending on how well uh, Calyx does here. Kind of wish I was abandoned now. That did a whole lot, though. It definitely tells me it's more of a defensive variant. Um, or not defensive, more physically defensive than specially defensive. Um, since Thunderbolt did so much. All I'm basically going to hope here is that Earthquake is enough to KO. And then see if I can survive Furfro somehow. I don't believe Furfro gets anything weird. Though then again, I do believe Furfro gets Cutting Guard, that's awesome. So if it's a Rest Talk set, then this is, this is a battle that could go on forever. Um, and of course, whether or not... I, I speculate... Let's see. Come on! Get the KO! Get it! Get it! Get it! If the Salt... Ah! Can I survive this? Oh yes, yes, I am still like I'm I'm doing this. I'm doing this. That's that's the worst clutch live ever though. Like ever. I really needed every inch of my HP to be able to kinda deal with what's coming. Uh, it's definitely should be said here that I, I do believe the wishy-washy kills me here no matter what. I do believe it's wheeled down enough for that. Though, I could hope he spares me the embarrassment. <laughs> I think I lost by default anyway. Um, I would have been in a much better spot had I not sacked Raichu. Wow, yeah, I think I choked the game away with that in mind. Though I did not foresee Call Mine clearly. Um, oh, fuck. I did not need this. I did not need this.
Here's the thing though, I don't know how much damage Furfur do to me. I am not defensive in that... I like max HP roughly around there. But I am invested in attack, like I am supposed to do damage. Furfur comes in, alright. I know my play here. I must go for Toxic. Hoping it isn't risk talk. And hoping he doesn't have Toxic, that's also a factor. Um, basically, what I need to stop him from doing is... Uh, setting up cutting guards. Though, Earthquake is... Yeah, that's... Uh, yeah, exactly. Um, since his fur coat, cutting guard will be super annoying. Like I said, I probably lost by default. But I think I lose it with style due to that crit mid game against the BHM. Kinda, kinda made a half-ass comeback. Retaliate. Okay. That's not gonna work. So that's probably the thumbnail animation right there. Um, <laughs> now here's the question though. Um, is it double the power at first? Is it leftovers? It is leftover, right. So now his hardest attacking went and he barely cut through. So all I'm really hoping now is that we don't see uh, Toxic. If we don't see Toxic I should be fine against this. If we see Toxic then... Oh that's it. <laughs> like that's a wrap from the get go. So um, yeah I think I still should annoy him enough. I don't know how much Earthquake will do, I just know it's unaffected by the fur coat. Crote, coat. Does he return? That's not gonna work. That's that's a lockdown. As return does, return Earthquake does. Very, very little. That was a crit. Okay, okay, I see you. Um, Alright, it's whether or not I recover more than I lose. I don't think so, no, I'm definitely losing more HP. Um, is it whether or not Toxic kind of pushes the boundary a little bit there? Um, let's see, I am 48. Do something weird, Carl. Just, like, switch out. Come on, I know you want to. Choke this game away. Choke this game away, Carl. I see you. Thinking of being smart, losing the wishy washy form. I can't even remember how much was left on the wishy washy. Let's see, from 48 to 18. Oh, that, that was a crit. Okay, this this game, I was like, I, it did way more than I could possibly remember. Um, let's see, an earthquake. Yeah, that's kinda, kinda bad. Though I'm pretty sure, um, I'm pretty sure we kill him next turn. Um, and as long as I doesn't don't get a crit against me again, my golem should be fine. As I could probably go for a weird play here. Man, I really wish I had like curse or something like that. Just to kinda gamble it. Um I'm gonna go for Stone Edge just to get a better animation. Um It sounds weird, but I just kinda wanna go through this later. I kinda wanna just look at the possible thumbnails it could be. Um, because return won't kill me anyway. If it doesn't score another crit, come on, Calix! Such a champ, though. Such a champ. Ah, we miss. Which is okay, because the Toxic does KO him here. <laughs> so, um, dumb play, but with the right thoughts in mind. As, um, we're gonna be dealing with the wishy washy. We, we have a pretty okay situation I think. Um, we're definitely faster. Though so, like I said I can't remember how much HP was left in the blue beast. That's too much. That is too much. We cannot KO this. We cannot KO this. What I need to go for is a stone edge crit. That's my play. That is my play. I have nothing else to do here. Damn it, this wishy washy though. From turn two, it's like, yeah, I'm doing this, you know, it's all me. 
Come on, crit, 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 crit. <laughs> I don't even hear crit. Suck a donkey, Carl! <laughs> oh, I will never, never will I let you forget this. Never. <laughs> oh my God, that was that was awesome. Um, I, I will, I, I will, I will be honest here. That crit on BM, it's, it's. Everything in this game, the that was disgustingly cool. Uh, <laughs> well, guys, okay, um, Carl, GG, buddy. Um, this I'm gonna hold this over your head forever. Um, <laughs> for everybody else who watched, uh, thank you for doing this. I hope you enjoyed this as much as I do. That was uh, that was the most unfair win I ever ever have gotten. That is, I, I love it. I love every second of it. Uh, <laughs> Alright guys, thank you as always for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Until then, take care.